Aries. Let's see what we get for you. Here we go. Three cards for you, three cards for your person, and a likely outcome. I feel like you're in a hev heavily suspicious energy. You're very healing of in and of yourself. But you maybe have tried to use work as a distraction for yourself. You really have a lot of sexual energy on your mind. Maybe you want to send this towards a person. But I feel like some uh, a lingering sadness is making you hesitate. Not sadness. Some unclarity. Some disparity. Something that you're missing. I feel like this person may not be communicating with you. It's something like that. You feel like there are too many questions rather than answers and you feel like you have no other choice but to stand from afar. I feel like you're taking care of yourself though. Your self-care routine is very high at this point in time. And this person may have felt like you have miscommunicated them or they feel like they have to manipulate you or get attention from somewhere else to get some leverage in the situation. I feel like there's a disconnect between you and them. I feel like you have a loving feeling towards them still, a passionate feeling towards them still, but this person may uh, not be wanting to be exclusive. That is the main energy at this point in time. I feel like you feel they are a manipulator. This could be the uh, mother of your children, father of your children. Um... Yeah, well, I'm saying this person is dealing with a lot right now. It has nothing to do with you. Like, on this side, maybe you feel like it didn't work out with them, so you felt like you lost something. But this person, whatever they worked on instead of you, maybe they're really suffering about that right now. Um, their opinion of you is maybe you're trying to manipulate them, so they really want to distance themselves from you. But uh, something totally unrelated to what's going on with you is, like, falling apart in their life, and they can't even blame you about it. So they want to... The only way that they could leverage against you is to have multiple people that they're pursue, so they don't feel dumb when you call them unbalanced because you're casting judgment on this person, right? Uh, you've had a lot of time to think about it and you know how to feel, but you're still open to something casual with them. But I feel like you, you're more pissed that it didn't work out with the Eight of Pentacles reverse. You really want to just continue to make yourself solid right now because you can't rely on this person to be stable with you unfortunately it's, it's, the, it's the energy that you are already seeing with this area so what's the likely outcome on this let's see though the lovers reverse i feel like you're making a choice like to separate um you don't feel like you owe this person anything i feel like this person may feel that way as well you know and you you don't regret meeting them, though. Something you like to do. Okay, let's see. What's my... Let's move on to Taurus. Five of Cups showing itself. Maybe a lot of things about the past, a lot of regrets maybe concerning some maternal figure, or maybe someone who you felt like being with forever. Maybe you finding yourself having to forgive something. Let's see what we got from my Taurus. Eight of Wands, messages coming in, fast movement, overseas travel. Getting a message. I feel like you'd be maybe getting a message that this uh, connection is not going to be working out or you're going to be sending a message that is like that, uh, Torres. You're going to be maybe telling this person straight up that uh, it wasn't something so as so serious as it could have been. Maybe you're feeling this disconnect. You're feeling very burdened by this connection and you want to give it up because 
you don't feel that uh, th there was something falsified about this dream that this person weaved with you. Maybe it was very serious at one point. We could tell that this person is not connected with your spiritual higher good. And I feel like you're being very open about that. I feel like this person has taken some time away from this relationship and this connection. Maybe um, maybe they haven't had time to give. Maybe they were being very spoiled with your attention. And once they had you or something like that, something shifted. This person started to have a lot of problems, start piling up. And you, I guess you decided to distance yourself from this. Something that you both intended to grow and this person is in their head about it. But they feel like they can now make a choice closer. I feel you both may be agreeing to this contract or disband. Some serious discussion here. I feel like, and if it's not that, if it's not that you feel like you have to separate because of um, a miscommunicated expectation when it came to your connection. If you felt like that, um, if it's not that, right? It could be some communication of a contractual matter or manner uh, stirred things up in your family life. Um, and it could be that there was some discussion over how things would have to boil over. You're trying to fix it out. You're making sure not to be taken advantage of by this person. And I feel like, uh, you know, you, you don't have any positive uh, emotions about how you're choosing to carry it out, right? You, you don't feel anything good about it, but you don't want to be destroyed by the situation. And that's how I'm seeing uh, your heart right now, Taurus. What else you have here? Uh, some old blood is not dying, is dying hard, right? Like some people from your past may be trying to cling back to you uh, very seriously at this time, Taurus. Um, they have a lot of fears of being abandoned uh, or risking their happiness. And they try to vest that on you, but it's through emotional manipulation. I'm seeing that with the King of Cups in reverse. So you may want to keep an eye out for all of this stuff. Okay, what else does Taurus need to know? There will be some healing after this. I feel like you may uh, have to reject somebody or tell somebody that thing, things aren't, are going to be better in a different way. Um, or this could also be a delayed uh, dream. Uh, it may take a while before you're able to get over this past cycle that keeps hurtling itself in your mind. Maybe there's a deception in your past that you couldn't forgive or some kind of two-timing energy that was around you. And I'm seeing that you uh, will take the steps to heal it, but it all depends on you and your patience and how much you hold back from being driven to... For, to an impulse, right? Don't let it take you, right? I'm seeing you're the empress. You're gonna have better luck with this time of it around. This time around. Gemini. I feel like you're trying to get some information before you send a message here, Gemini. I feel like you're trying to get as much information you can about someone that you were connected with romantically. I feel like you're trying to look up the details of what their, if they have any issues or if they've um, had any relationships in the past. What you're trying to look up, trying to look up, is this person like unfaithful? Are they fraudulent? Are they a cheater? You're kind of looking those kind of informations up. Um, I see that you two are kind of like connecting really well though. I think that maybe you both don't have any vision of a long-term thing right here. Maybe you both are like coming off that way that like, oh, uh, we you know it doesn't have to be uh committed or whatever or stable or whatever you're not sharing any finance or whatever but it's like you're saying that oh but we look good together blah blah 
So here we go with the two of cups and the six of wands. I feel like you're with a couple that you you are with somebody that makes you feel very proud of yourself. Uh, it's the same character in both of these cards, right? So you feel like this person really generates a lot of fanfare around you. This person is feeling like they gained a new perspective on family. Maybe they're trying to push away um, higher commitment in this energy. But I feel like in the outcome here, you both are going to have uh, an agreement. The person you're dealing with, Gemini, the person you're dealing with, excuse me, is thinking about family. But the Hierophant in reverse, I don't know what is their intention with that. Four of Swords reverse. Something may be coming out about some details. It may have to do with tradition. It may have to do with uh, them. their selection of a partner may not be within this energy. Seeing between you. Um, but the other thing though here is I'm seeing that you don't really mind that either. You want to stay open as well. If they're not going to do it, you don't care. But you're trying to get that information ahead of time. Because this is someone you do uh, share deep feelings with. You feel like you have a connection with them. You're not going to give it up easily it feels like. And... That's what it looks like. It's not telling me any more than that. Um, I feel like you're always up to like keeping up if this person may be dishonest with you. But I feel like you guys are going to become it, coming into a better agreement. You may be confronting any lies that were t uh, taking place. And you're going to have a new start here. It could be with this person or without. I'm seeing it's with. But. But what? I feel like if it does extend, you may catch them in another injustice later with the devil and the justice. This person may be dealing with a lot of addictions. They just can't seem to change how they are and go towards the future, you know? This is the kind of drama that I'm seeing you having to deal with over and over again. So, that's what I got for you, Gemini. I know that sucks. But, I don't get to decide what I see here. All right, guys, so let's see Cancer, right? There are similar cards for Aries here. You may be dealing with an Aries. I feel like you have very hungover type feelings for somebody. A Leo could be. Leo or water sign. Um, you feel like there is information missing. Something you want to know or understand about someone uh, in your life. They could be Virgo, Leo, or like I said, Aries. Because there were similar cards for Aries in there. Um, you... Are finally moving on from some past pattern of sadness but there is lingering evidence that some part of it you don't want to leave maybe there's something good in what you had in the past and you could be reminiscing about that a lot with the star the ace of cups the eight of cups reverse this person that uh you were connecting with cancer they could be um really hiding information about themselves they're really um dealing with their own life and other manipulators in their life maybe they could be um dealing with them through messages i feel like this person is single right now they're really working on their art or they have something that they're building and waiting for they're waiting for something new to happen this month uh this person really can't uh stop thinking about you either it says here that 
with the empress reverse of the moon maybe you both try to like go in different directions but the moon keeps bringing you back in some way with the eight of cups reverse see there's moon in there and here um it's something that this person may be still waiting for your message or something like that it seems like they are growing things on their own and they are waiting for things to get better this person seems to have some kind of confirmation of that with the page of swords reverse ace of cups i'm saying like this person is just very to themselves they're doing whatever they can to make their life better and they're hiding that information they're hiding all their suffering they're hiding their pain they're hiding their vices person is growing and they're hiding it they're hiding every single bit of their information this person is in their power but they're really avoiding drama this person is a committed person they're only going to build their pentacles Here's something that else is coming up with that. This person could be drinking or learning a new skill, becoming stronger in many ways, emotional, death and strength. What else does cancer need to know? Was the outcome here four of wands <laughs> you you may be going towards a relationship with this person after something else comes to a end something of deception comes to an end you may be going towards that emperor character with the four the four resonates with four right somebody is going to be telling the truth about family situation that's the reading i'm seeing here with cancer okay that's really Good and short reading.